Greetings, and welcome to my first ever AC6 build video. In this video, I'm going to be showcasing my first build, I suppose, Godspeed. Inspired from the DC Comics Speedster of the same name, this build is designed to be as fast and as aggressive as possible. So let's get into all the specs of the build itself. First, for our primary weapons, we have dual stun guns. These are incredibly fast. They have yellow electricity, which is, you know, kind of matches the flow of the build and the inspiration overall. And their recharge slash reload is incredibly fast. So you can just shoot out all of one clip of one of the guns and then just alternate between the two over and over. And it will seem as if you have infinite ammo. Obviously, if you get really close and you want to really build up that poise, just shoot both at the exact same time, right up close to them, make sure you hit them, and you will see the outcome being very, uh, favorable. As well, if you're familiar with the bleed mechanic in Elden Ring, this is kind of the same with the electrical discharge. Basically, these build up a mini stun, similar to the poise break, the uh, stance break when your enemy stuns and takes direct hit damage. These are like that. You hit them enough with these, it will build up, they'll stun. Same as the stun needle launcher. You hit someone with this, they're going to be stunned. These uh, stun guns that do the same effect, it's very nice. And for our shoulder mounts, we have the bullet orbit. This sends out a little drone that kind of just, you know, shoots bullets at your enemy. Uh, this builds up a lot of uh, poise, as well as just does pretty decent direct damage. These do go on recharge every now and again, so you have to pretty much throw them out, let them do their damage, preferably get close before you activate them, and then once they go on cooldown, you can either play a little bit defensively, or still just keep on the pressure with your stuns. The main point of these with the build is to just keep on the pressure, never let them breathe really. As well as the character Godspeed in DC Comics has the ability to move so fast to create uh, pretty much speed mirages, multiple of himself it would appear. So this is kind of cool having uh, two extra guns to fire that you don't need to actually shoot, they just kind of act independently. For the helmet I just chose something that has really good stats in all defenses, AP, system recovery, scan, Pretty much the best I could, considering it doesn't really add too much weight to the build. And we got ourselves the Notch family core, arms, and legs. The arms have very good, uh, what's it called? They have max, in fact, firearm specialization, which will help us with the tracking. Because these stun guns, they're good and they shoot a lot, but they're similar to an SMG where their accuracy really isn't that great at a further range. So you really want to get close. So this helps out a lot to make sure that your no, hits land on target. And the legs, of course, because not only are they a reverse joint, which means they can jump really high, which will allow us to stay in the air a lot, which is kind of going to be the game plan. We're going to really try to stay above our enemy flying above them, as well as these have amazing, since they're lightweight, they can uh, hop around a lot really quick. And for boosters, I choose these because these allow us to get in the air quick and stay up the air longer. They have a great energy efficiency when it comes to just hovering, kind of. But if you like to stick to the ground a little more, although I don't really recommend it, but if you want to be on the ground and never be really hit by much, I recommend these gills. These allow you to pretty much uh, dodge around really, really fast. Uh, make sure you never get hit on the ground. But I don't really recommend it because a lot of missiles will hit the ground and the splash damage might hit you. But then again, you are really fast. But you'll be using a lot of your energy boosting around, so be wary of that. And for the FCS, we're going to choose the max close range assist one, considering we are going to be real up close and personal. And for generator, the NGI, considering it has a lot of capacity, which allows us to, you know keep our energy high up as well as its recharge ability since it is a coral generator once we run out of energy it will refill much faster than if we were to just sit there and let it recharge and the most customizable part of this uh, whole build is the expansion you can go assault armor if you want to get really close and then explode on them i like pulse armor because i can just either activate it to reset some stun and get my bearings back if i'm getting my ass beat or i can activate it and go full gun it just go against the enemy not caring about the damage i take just doing as much as I can while the armor lasts. And that is pretty much everything you need to know about the build. Let me know if you enjoyed it. Let me know if there's anything you would change, what other builds I should do. And uh, yeah, enjoy the battle. We'll see how it does indeed. Uh, give yourself a good one. Peace. Alrighty, first match of the day. What are we fighting? Oh boy, dual zims, dual stun. Maybe it's a tanky boy. Yeah, looks a lot like a tankier build I've made too. I guess it's just the appropriate parts for such a build. Right, we'll see what we do. This should be an ultimate test of uh, if I can stack against the ultimate tanks, I guess. Gotta get in a spot where my, uh, my boys can do their damage. Oh, you fire both at the same time. I would not do the. Gotta keep my distance a little bit. Don't want to get dual zooms like that. 
Okay. Oh, my boys are on a cooldown. That's not good. They're back up. Let's go. Shit. 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 Nice. We're chilling. <laughs> this is a fucking battle, me puggles. Now we chill off for a second. We gotta zip around a lot so we don't get hit by those dual zims. We can go in for the kill. Ice! Oh my god. 2500 HP, not so bad. That was a battle though, oh my god. Because I'm the ultimate skinny boy against the ultimate big boy. Oh boy. <laughs> Either way, it's fun, man. Even if I lose, this is fun. I'm down for this. He's got like max height, look at this guy. Oh, so you can get the drop on me with uh, those stuns. Should I get the uh, little stun off him? Where's he going? His strategy is uh, something else. Our droids are back. About to get a real stun off him in a second. Yep, there we go. They capitalize on it. Although that positioning could have been better. Are you giving up? Oh god. I'm sorry, Broski. I didn't mean it. I'm sorry. I guess we, we end it now, I guess. Yikes. I'm sorry, brother. Let my droids kill you. <laughs> I'm so sorry, dude. I didn't mean to be that unfun. I understand this build can be really tough. You know, just gun them down. Doesn't feel like it's much you can do, but it's a bad matchup. He should have been. Or he, he would have been better if he was a bit faster, but he was really slow, really tanky. Alrighty, second match. What kind of AC are we fighting? Ooh, a laser boy. Okay, dual lasers. Plasma on the right, or left anyway. I don't know what's the other shoulder mount is though, I can see it. Let's do our best. She's just scanned probably a little later. Ah, Jesus Christ, what the? I didn't know ammo. Alright, round two. Back, baby. Didn't mean to put that one away. Just muscle memory, I guess. Yikes, brother. GG. He's fine. This build is not bad. Bad. Ah, oh, good support. Good job, Chiba. It's always good to see the evolution of ACs. Fight them once, and they change a bit, and a bit, and a bit, until they're perfect. Or as close as it can be. Alright, here we go again. Same opponent. Third round, huh? What the hell? That kind of looks cool. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, That's awesome. Okay, this is going to be tough, though. 
I gotta really make sure I don't get hit by those uh, shoulder mounts. Those could like insist on me, no doubt. I was trying to get the high ground immediately. Gotta make sure I alternate between my uh, stuns, but it always seems like I have infinite. Oh, my boys are off cooldown, that's not preferable. We got a stun boy. Oh, now, we've, now we're losing. It's not looking great. Can we bring it back though? At 800 RP. Maybe. Ah, oh, GG. Yeah, you better this time. Preferably. Bring we in. Probably should use my uh, pulse armor just a little bit faster. Yeah, Gex, GG. Alright, we're having another match against this guy. It's pretty good. Oh boy. Yeah, I feel like this this build right here could do really good against my Godspeed. This has much more of a, a range to it, but hopefully I can close the distance. Doesn't look like it's too good for uh, going up. But we'll see. Even more aggressive. Maybe a little more energy, maybe. I'm seeing the run out every single time I get up there. Alright, we do this. Reset her stun. The good old bait and switch, you see. Throws it back. He's not looking super saucy, but neither is his, so. Come on! Come on! No! Oh my god, I couldn't get out of there, man. Ah, oh, this doesn't last long. Oh, my recovery is not there. Alright, okay. We're gonna try again. We're gonna try to really close the distance this time. Really need to use cover to get closer. I'm gonna go full for it. Already, huh? I thought to pop it, honestly. Probably also got a time sending out my uh, my little four bits a little bit better. Pop this, we're gonna get punished too much. We're gonna work on staying above him a lot. Nice. All right, we're coming back. We're gonna come back. I'm sure I could probably do something a little better, you know? My Drew is coming back. Nice, they're back. But just don't miss. Oh shit! <laughs> oh, that almost thought I died. Oh, that is GG's. My God, this is a good opponent. This will teach me a lot about my build, how to use it effectively. Alrighty, next round again. Same person. We'll see if the build's any different. Yep, different build. Oh, they got Orbis as well. This might be pretty tough. That duck it does a lot of poise damage, so I'll try to move side to side real quick so I don't get hit by too much. Damn, that sounded me so fast. That was really good. Oh no, not pulse armor. <laughs> or not uh, assault armor, dear god! That's my weakness! 
is really good against this build though, because I get really close, so I don't have really the uh, patience to stay away. Oh, this could be it. Yes! Oh my god. Dude, my orbits came in fucking clutch, man. Oh my god. They stunned him at just the right time. Oh my god. Alright. Oh my god. This is tough, man. This is tough, but I like it. It's pushing me to be uh, better. Both orbits are out. Very nice. I'll pulse this up real quick just because I don't really want to get stunned at all. Back away from that. Really don't want to get hit. Reset my recharge. Get me so high up. I'll wait till he comes down, wait till he burns a bit of energy, and then I'll go up. No good, no good, no good. Gotta retake the lead. Come up. Keep going like that so we can't hit. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, GG. Stay so far away, man. <laughs> I can't close in on that range. Oh, boy. Got our work cut up for us this time, I guess. Alright, 1 1. We can bring it back. that out a bit. Yeah, stun him up. Put on the heat. We have the health advantage, we can be we can be aggressive. Okay, can we hold it? Die <laughs> GG's again man. Oh my god. Yeah I feel like this build's pretty solid. You just gotta get used to using it effectively is what's up. All right, same person. This person's very generous, uh, sticking around, offering a lot of different ACs. I think we have something different this time as well. Oh yeah. Okay, a lot of pulse damage. Interesting. I guess my uh, my pulse armor is not gonna really do much here, other than reset stun, I guess. All right, let's ride. But they don't do a lot of damage. They just really specialize in that kind of stuff. But we'll see. I could be made a believer of the bubbles. We'll see. Gotta capitalize on that damage. Yeah. Oh my god. That damage right there at the end was that stacked up. I got a little too greedy there. I just went tanking. We gotta be a little more evasive. It's just I don't have the stamina to keep flying up and being super evasive. I have a lot, but not enough often. You know what I mean? Oh my god, that was quick. Oh my. That was fucking quick, man. I, I do be the fastest build alive. Alrighty, last bout. Let's see who wins, shall we? Okay. Okay, missiles to avoid. Moonlight to avoid, uh, plasma to avoid, and something else. Oh boy, it's gonna, it's gonna be something. We'll see what it is. Gonna hide from the scanner. There we go. There it is. And we pop out our droids about now. This missile's hard to dodge. Oh, they can't be anyone. Gotta get to the ground so I can jump up. There we go. We're above him. I'm surprised that reached me. He's on a lot of terrain here. So we'll pop this, try to go full aggression with our joys back. Maybe we'll bring it back. Yes! 
Yes! We did it! Oh my god. I was surprised that worked. I was thinking, oh shit, I should have used my Pulse Armor earlier before I got to this health. Nope, it worked out. Let's go. Strats. Oh, over there. Oh, you don't want me to be above you, man. I want to capitalize on the stun. Ooh, ooh. That was a great fight, man. That was... Oh, man. That was something. <laughs> G to the G's, brother. G to the G's.